Hey guys, LBS here again, your tech guide. So today we are going to be checking out some iPhone XR cases. Right here we've got some from iBlazin and also from Clayco. I don't know if they are the same company or not, but anyways, this is the one that they sent out to me to test out. And for the iPhone XR, here it is. And also at the same time, we are checking out my new camera. This is the Fuji X-T3. We're going to check out how the autofocus is like and how the color looks like in the final video. So also the audio as well. So listen to the audio. I am using the Rode wireless mic on the T3. And yeah, so let's open this up, guys, and see what it looks like on all all of these cases so this one here is glyco all right and right now we are shooting at 4k 60 frame per second so just uh, check out how the quality looks like on that and here is the first one we've got here it's got a rubbery texture feel to it and it looks like we do have a what is that tempered glass oh okay it looks like it's got a built-in glass to it so let me just try to um, take this apart guys just give me a second there you go all right so listen to the autofocus as well guys let's see if the wireless uh, mic will uh, pick it up or not so let's just slide this in there like so and put this over it it should snap in quite easily let's just remove this guys and there you go well protected guys super well protected you got the screen tempered glass on the front on the back You've got your volume rocker protected as well. Expose your silent mode switch. Your bottom are exposed. And your power button here is covered. Camera is well protect protected as well. You do have enough elevation on the back to protect it. And also on the front as well. Plenty of lip on the outer side there okay so there you go that is the first one so now let's move on to the next so look at that design guys beautiful beautiful all right so i might be giving these cases away for free guys since i don't have the iphone 10r this is just a dummy that i'm using right now but definitely just uh, leave me a message if you guys are interested in these cases if not i will put a link in the description below if i do eventually give them away so links will be down below if you guys are interested but other than that whoever's uh, whoever watching this video first come first serve hit me up and i'll send you guys these cases for free looks very nice well protected so the thing about this camera i notice is that if you move this case here on the side it will not focus it doesn't have any wide angle zooming focus range whereas the sony 6500 you're able to focus from the side whereas this one it needs to be centered to be focused which is the thing that i really really that which really bothers me a lot guys because sometimes i hold the object on the side here and i want it to focus and it just doesn't focus guys so you have to center it right in the middle to get the focus as you can see right there i tried all the settings i there's just no way to focus it from the side unless you want to shoot manual but anyways that's what it looks like the case guys okay let's go for the last case all right so you've got your flap there to access your uh, your plug and here it is you just have to snap this on and boom and then just clip this on your belt 
and you are ready to go guys so that's pretty much it guys um, just a little quick video review on these cases from iBlazin and also at the same time we, we, we are just checking the new camera the Fuji X-T3 the autofocus and how it performs when I'm actually using it as a product review on my channel so if you guys have any other questions just leave me a comment down below and once again guys thank you for watching until then I'll see you guys on the next one peace